Question number eight. A table is sold at Kenya shillings 4,500 and a chair uh, at Kenya shillings 2,000. A salesman earns a commission of 8% on every table and 5% on every chair sold. On a certain week, he sold three more chairs than tables and his total earnings were at uh, Kenya shilling 3,980. Determine the number of chairs he sold uh, that week. So we are told the table cost 4,500 Kenyan shillings. So we can start by saying, let X be the number of tables. So it means uh he sold that week if the number of tables were x uh you multiply by the cost of one table which is 4500 you add he sold three more chairs than tables so it means that uh, he was getting uh, now before we do that so this is the amount he sold for the table and he was getting a commission of eight percent so we multiply by 0.08 which is the same as 8 of 100. Then you add the commission uh, the salesman got from chairs. So the number of chairs were three more. So it is X plus three. Uh, you multiply by 2000 and uh, he was getting a commission of 5%. So it is 0 0.05 or five of 100. This uh, is equal to the amount that he earned that is uh, 3980 so we can uh, now work on this and say uh, if we multiply here uh, we multiply 45 multiply by 0 0.08 uh, you'll be able to get 360 X then we have plus uh, the other one you get uh, you'll be able to get uh, this is a uh, we multiply this uh, that is a uh, 2000 you multiply by 0 0.05 you'll be able to get uh, you'll be able to get 100 100 uh, then uh, that is 100 X and the other one will give us uh, you, that is 100 you multiply by X you get 100 3 times 100 you get 300 is equals to 3980 uh, then you add the x you get 460 x you take 300 to the other side you'll be able to get uh, 300 minus 3980 you get 3680 so you divide both sides by 460 you divide by 460 uh, so x is equal to you use your calculator uh, you'll be able to get x is 8 and because he, the salesman sold three more chairs than table and x is the number of tables uh, so we say number of chairs sold is equal to 8 plus 3 which is 11 chairs so that's how you work out that and you'll be able to get 3 marks